Hello, my soccer universe. Uh, you know that I like collecting Italian teams. My problem is that some of the Italian teams that I have been collecting recently, they have been getting relegated. So for my review videos, my Italian background is getting rather, rather, rather thin. This is where this parcel comes in. This is a jersey from a team that will for sure play in the 23-24 season, like Salernitana. And I'm very pleased to say that and that I have that jer uh, jersey, which I found on Wilhaben for a somewhat reasonable price, given that it has a name set. I sell a point, I think 50 for it. I submitted a bit for 40 and it got accepted and I'm, I'm actually quite pleased that uh, the seller did accept that because um, 50 mile, mile might have been too much. It is, a, uh, especially since it's a jersey that is size L, so I know already, given when you order from Italian teams and it's not one of the big companies, L is typically too tight. This XL, although it doesn't fit too badly, um, it is a little bit tight, so I expect the L to be also fitting quite tightly. I am also excited about this one because I always said that uh, this team has a color scheme that I would really love to have on my background uh, for the simple reason it adds a little bit more color because it's all these blue and dark red tones that are dominating Serie A and so having a little bit of a brighter color scheme is for sure fun. We are talking, of course, it's a self-made jersey. So that is exciting. We're talking, of course, about Lecce. This is the jersey from the 1920 season. I can already see it is kind of small, but it is also kind of rare to get this. I've been looking at the beginning of the 22-23 season how can I get Lecce jer jerseys and you find them here and there on eBay, but they're rather unreasonable priced from the store. It's not so bad, but you pay for shipping. So in that case, yeah, I'm actually quite pleased to get this for a total of 45, including the shipping. I actually like the thin striping. It is sponsorless, which is also a little bit of a plus uh, as the nice logo with the wolf. And of course, as I said, it is uh, self-produced. You see the wolves head here and then 902. So yeah, uh, that's pretty cool. I said it comes with a name set and you know, typically for, before I show you the name set, tip, typically for self-produced shirts, every most of the stuff is sublimated like the logo here on the sleeves and all this. There, uh, there's only one simple seam going, but I think what tops it off is the really nice name set. I think it's Federico Falco. Falco, of course, being a famous artist from Austria, um, Rock Me Amadeus. So that actually <laughs> kind of fits. And yeah, I also like as an addition because Lecce is really, that city of Lecce is really on the heel of the boot. Very sunny. And so we have a little bit of the sun going in there. You may say it's overly uh, designed but I actually like this little note but I really am pleased with that name set it's a really really cool shirt I gotta say Ta-da! now you can see from a distance as I said really really pleased with that one I really love the thinner striping uh, maybe we can talk about the shoulders and a few things I'm also pleased that it's sponsorless because Lecce, I mean, the sponsors that season were not that bad, but on the other side, um, it well, makes a little bit look more messy here. It's a cleaner look, I gotta say, and I'm pleased with that. And as I said, I'm very pleased to hang this up on my background for Serie A because it adds a little bit more color. I also thought I'd give you a better look of the name set. Looks cool. Looks cool. Although, why all in lowercase letters? That was a fad that I thought died out uh, with Puma in the mid 2010s. But hey, more power to you if you want to be unique. As I said, I like Falco as a, a na name that it's a number 10. Really, really pleased. Please let me know what you think about this jersey. Give a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. I'll talk to you soon with more unpackings. Bye. 
Hey there, I really hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, here are some videos and playlists that you might enjoy too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel and hit the little bell icon so you get notified whenever something happens in my soccer universe. And with that, have a wonderful day. Bye!